Hello everyone, and welcome to my channel. In this video, I explain to you how to create a GPO, and apply it to domain users. This policy prevent, or block the user from using any media programs. For example, if you have more than one application to play media, and you want to close them all, or close any of them, and you do not want to exhaust yourself, by removing them from the client's computers. You can create a policy from the server, and apply it to prevent all media programs from running. Open the server running Windows Server 2022, and open the Server Manager dashboard. Then, click on Tools menu at the top of the page, and from the menu, click on Group Policy Management. After opening Group Policy Management, go to the left side, and expand the faucet, and select the domain that you will work on. Then right-click on the organizational unit that you want to apply the policy to, and from the menu, click on Create a GPO in this domain, and link it here. Then enter an appropriate name, for this policy in the new GPO window, then click the OK button. Next, right-click on the GPO that was just created, and from the menu, click on Edit. This will open the Group Policy Management Editor window. And after opening the Group Policy Management Editor, from the left side, expand the folders, to access the path shown in front of you on the screen. After reaching the path, go to the other side of the available policies, and double-click on Don't Run Specified Windows Applications Policy. After opening Don't Run Specified Windows Applications Policy, enable this policy and then click on the show button, to display the list of programs that are prohibited from running. You can add the media programs that you want to prevent, from playing in this list, but you will write the name, of the file to run the application. I will return to the client's computer to find out file name, of the application that you want to prevent from opening. For example, to prevent VLC Media Player application, right click on the application, and from the menu, click on properties. You will find the name of the application launch file followed by exe, save the name well, and the same thing with the Windows Media Player application, right click on the application, and from the menu, click on properties to find out the name of the application launch file. And after knowing the name of the application launch file, go back to the server, and write the name of the application launch file, that you want to prevent from running. Then click on the OK button, you can later add another application to the same list, or remove an application, then click on the apply and ok button. You can now close the open windows, after that I will go back to the client computer, to test the new policy on it. You can now restart the client's computer, or type the update group policy command, the best, and easiest is the update command. Open the command prompt, and type the command that appears on the screen. After completing the update successfully, close the command prompt, and run any VLC media player, or Windows media player. And you will find that the application has been prevented, from working permanently. This method is very useful instead of removing the application. Because you may need to run the application at a later time, instead of installing the application, and removing it, you can prevent it from running, and allow it to run at any time you want. I hope the video will be useful to you. And thank you for watching. And I also hope to subscribe to my channel. Thank you all.